Hello, it's KMA. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. This is a weekly update um, for this week. It's Monday. I usually put them out on Friday or Saturday. But I'm a little bit late this week because I wasn't feeling well and I've been kind of busy. But <laughs> whatever. It's Monday. Ready for the week. Yay. The election tomorrow. Ooh. Boy, can we have another option, please. But enough of that crap. Basically, uh, this is the last week of hell. Um, I work for the post office and I work in a place where most of the people in the town leave the town in the summer because nobody wants to be in the temperatures down here in South Florida in the summer. So what the post office does is they combine two or three routes sometimes into one route in the summer. And then when all the people come back, which is usually the second week of October, uh, they split the routes up again. But for some reason, they've decided to wait a couple extra weeks because they can save money by paying people minimal money for doing extremely uh, demanding work. Uh, they've delayed the splitting of the routes until the 14th, uh, I think, the 12th maybe, which is basically this Saturday. So that I have one more week of the combined routes where I'm working 14 to 1,500 customers when a full-time 60-hour-a-week um, route usually has 850, 900 customers on a lower-end uh, mail volume route. So we are overburdened. I'm doing about 100 hours worth of work in each week. Uh, I'm not actually putting in that time, but that's what the routes are evaluated at. So I'm kind of like, you know, knee-deep, head-deep, whatever, in mail. Uh, but this is the last week of it, and on Saturday will be the first week where the routes will be cut, and it will be interesting to find out how quickly I can do the routes then. But seeing that they're going to be cut, I'm not going to be going to work at 6 or 6.30 or even 5.30 like I have been some days. I'm going to be going to work back at 7 a.m., which means I have time again to record content before I go to work, which is my normal MO when I'm doing creative content on YouTube. So YouTube videos will start coming out again slowly but surely. Um, and also, seeing that they're shorter days, I can get home a little bit earlier and I might be able to actually stream a little bit after work. And I'm looking forward to that because I'd really want to get into the streaming um, because I feel most comfortable when I'm streaming. Um, it's a little uncomfortable until I hit start streaming. Once I hit start streaming and I start making sentences, it's like, oh yeah, I remember, I like doing this, this is quite fun, but beforehand, I'm a little nervous about it, so I just get to get over that little nervousness, and I'll be fine with it, um, and also, in the future, I would like to start doing collaborations with people I hang out with now, um, especially if I do have the free time, and I'm able to make the content that I want to make, so keep an eye out for some collaborations and one of the people I'm looking at is Jan.com. I would love to make a video series with you or even a stream series or something that would be interesting because um, your goals are not too much different than mine and I think uh, if I could help you reach your goals that would help me reach my goals. So um, in the future I will be asking her for a collaboration and maybe even Art of Mana who is going to be looking at my stream content and help guide me into making better content and become a better streamer. Uh, so basically that is it. Uh, one more week of hell for me and then I can start getting content back out. So guys have a great week. Um, cross your fingers that nothing crazy happens tomorrow with the elections. Um, I don't like either of them just so you know but I'm going to be voting for Hillary Clinton because I'm a Democrat. Actually I'm with the Green Party which is Jill Stein but you know I'm in Florida, and um, Florida could go either way, so I better be voting Hillary Clinton. And if you don't like your presidential candidates, still vote, uh, but look, do research on the lower candidates, the representatives, the senators, everybody else that you're going to be voting for, because those are the people that will become future presidents. And if you get good people into those slots now, in the future we will actually have choices that we actually um can recommend and enjoy as choices for president. Right now, we don't have those choices. We have shit and shit, too, and we don't like shit, and it's just a horrible situation that America's in, and it's kind of a situation that's kind of going around the world with Brexit and all that other stuff that's going on. But, you know, this is a political vlog, so I'm going to shut the F up, and they have a great day. This is KMA. Yeah. In another week or so, keep eye out for content. Peace!